What's up guys? Travis here with another episode of Fry Brothers Fishing and today I'm basically on a mission to rescue my bull shad. Took it out for the first time ever, caught a five pounder on it. Ten minutes later, set the hook into a log and that was that. So we're going swim baits only today. I'm gonna paddle this whole pond, hop a log jam, hop a beaver dam, paddle another pond, get all the way to the back and hopefully be able to reach my bull shad. That being said, we're pre-spawn, so the bass are up shallow, they're tight to cover, and uh, yeah, I got a good feeling about today, so get in the kayak and start catching some fish. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Sorry, little fish. Oh, I yanked it out of the water. All right. One down. That was a big hook set for a little fish. Cool. Thanks, dude. Yep. Shallows. I should have been fishing the whole time. So the only bites were shallow. And I mean, the fish came pretty aggressively at it, but then they'd like short strike it. So we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to figure that out. See if there's like shallow with wood, you know? Something, there's some variable I'm missing at this point. Oh. By the way, this is a pretty versatile bait. Oh, look at that. It followed me right here. <laughs> it was like a seven inch bass. But uh, this is a pretty versatile bait, guys. It's a. Uh, yeah, I'm a fan. I'm gonna I'm gonna buy more. I'm gonna keep using them. This is like the trout glider. A lot of people, I'm sure, are not going to like this bait. But when you learn how to use the bait, it's pretty good. I mean, you can wake this thing. You can use it like jerk bait. I'm just going with a stop and go, and it's it's got me a couple fish so far. But I'm still pretty new to using it. I'm no expert on it by any means, but. I know cheap baits. This feels like it's gonna be a good cheap bait. Oh, he's coming after it. He's coming after it. Oh, he bailed. Oh, there it is. Oh, that was a nice one too. That's a better fish. Not huge, but better. I'll take it. Yeah, pulling my boat. <laughs> oh, nice. Bigger than I thought. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Come on, give me some slack. Micro guides. Ooh, that was cold. Just crushed it. It's a hefty, I don't know, two and three quarters. It's hard to it's hard to tell with that gut. So to my brother in Florida, who 
I don't think once his name said on social media. I told you I'd send you one of these if you just catch a swim bait fish already. They're pretty fun. All right, look at that. It's a pretty fish. Easy. That was fun. Let's let's get another. Oh, that is a chunk. Dude. I don't know what to do. That was like a five pounder. Just swam by me. I couldn't cast at it because, you know, scared the thing. Big girls are on the move, Midwestern people. It uh, bites. Oh, there was a hit. Bites turned on in Ohio. Like, it's been time to catch a big fish for, you know, a month and a half two months. It's been that time, but now they're fat and aggressive. A fat man in a little boat. Aggressive, man. They're on the move. And they're casting the freaking moss. That, I see it. I see it. That's like a four pounder. Oh my god. Come on. That might go five. That's a nice fish. Let's just go ahead and take a moment to reflect on my excitedness and setting the hook when I see the hit and instead of feeling the hit and how it's costing me fish today. We're starting to make them, but I have yet to see a bed this year. No, I saw a couple. That's a lie. I saw a few. Yeah, she's right there. Do you guys see that? Do you guys see this fish? Oh jeez, just drag it through there. Hmm. Both of these look too nice and I don't know which way to go. Ooh. A little feisty, I saw you. We're hitting a very shallow area of this pond, like the final part. There could literally be fish anywhere in this in this last section. Oh, right over the duckweed. I need to do a giveaway sometime. I promise you guys a giveaway, and I keep forgetting to like do it. Uh, so you guys interested in those of you that watch our those of you that watch the channel, what are you interested in? You want you want the swim bait giveaway? I can paint up one of these. Oh, now I got the got the lettuce. <laughs> yeah, you want a swim bait or you just want like a crank bait? I mean, swim baits obviously catch grass monsters. <laughs> yeah. yeah, working on it, bud. Sorry, I got you back. Yeah, yeah. Do you guys want, we'll just count it as the one in 200 subscriber giveaway and I'll paint one of these mackerels. They obviously catch fish. See ya. Oh, 
That was an instant hit. Come on, everything's short striking me. <laughs> oh, this is. Oh, don't you hit that tree fishing pole? I need you. Yeah, dude, gonna be shallow fishing all day. Ooh. <laughs> Did you guys see that wake? <laughs> oh. Watched it beeline at my bait. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. This is so much fun. Alright, there she is. A little guy, but hit like a freaking champ. That was a good hit. <laughs> Did you guys see that wake? They are just mad today. I mean, you know it's a good day when your bait hits the water, you start moving it, and they wake right after it. It's probably that one, a little pound and a half. We're gonna go that way. Let me check my camera. Well, I might run out of battery on the way back. But I'm gonna try to finagle through there and go up this creek and not lose my rods in the process. Ooh, yeah, get up and over that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is all shallow. Oh, I'm one step closer to my bullshit. Ooh. They're so angry today. I love it. Freaking love it. Oh, there it was. It was like a two. How'd you not get hooks, bro? I see you. That is the beaver dam. There's a little gap of water and another beaver dam. I'm just gonna take out here, carry it around. All right, I moved some of my stuff. Oh, oh God. That was going down. The struggles of bank fishing come into the kayak world. I should have took the rest of the stuff out. This is heavy. Well, for this kayak, it's heavy. Take a couple casts before we burn the area with the kayak and get going. They usually don't come back here till summer, but it's shallow, so okay, there was two right there. A little, but they were there. This is a really nice frog spot in summer. So feisty. I see you little fella.
I'm slowly but surely getting closer to my bull shed. That's exciting, guys. Yeah, yeah, at that point down there, my bull shed's to the right of that. much harder to catch them over here not nearly the activity as the other pond oh man this isn't good I'm starting to wonder if I pass the tree with my my bait I think it's up there off, the, off those rocks because uh, I'm pretty sure there's a big big tree underwater there Not sure, but I think my book is over here. If it's not, then I truly forget which tree it's on, and I'm going to have to run this whole bank looking for it. I see it! Oh! Yes! There it is! I don't know how I'm gonna get it, but there it is! It's too, too low for me to actually reach. You guys see it? It's my bull shed. Let's see if I can get some hooks in it. Probably snag this too. What did it get on? There's a freaking bass right there. Bro, don't you eat my bullshit when I move this. What you looking at? I'll, I'll chase you away, bro. Yeah. See if I can snag the branch. I can pull it up. It's so close. Like, I could almost reach it, but I really don't want to flip. Okay. 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 Got it, got it, got it. Whew. Do not fall off. Do not flip. Yeah, stay there, bullshit. Oh, oh no. I can't see what's happening. Oh, it's still there. It's still there. I can't see. That feels like a bullshit. I got it. Don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. Come on, dude, pop off. Get out of the way. Oh, jeez. Yes! Oh, freaking success. Mr. Buka, I got your bait back. Okay, we're launched. Time to start the trip back. Whoa, let's go that way. I don't know if my audio picked that up, but that was a nice sounding fish. Just hit something at the surface. Gonna creep up on it. Try to run this little. Oh, geez. Screwed that up. Really screwed that up. Oh, treat it. 